What's up guys, Caesar Beavers here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make a thumbnail for YouTube, for your YouTube videos. I'm on the iPad Pro and I'm using a program called Procreate with an Apple Pencil. Okay, so first I do a dimensions of 3,840 by 2160, and it recommends 1920 by 1080, but I times that by two. Uh, as long as you don't go over two megabytes, then you'll be good. And even I found out on my iPad on YouTube Studio, I can actually, uh, it, it doesn't make me do that. So I, after I get the people cut out, I'm going to go find a background, right? And I got a subscription to Envanto Elements. Uh, it's pretty useful. There's a lot of elements on there. It comes with licenses and all that. So you can use it. I'm going to pick a brick wall in this case. There's a bunch of them on here. And you know, YouTube thumbnails, that's one of the most important things you can do when uploading a video because that's the first thing they see before you click it. So you really want a good thumbnail up there. Uh, so, you know, I'd, I'd suggest downloading Procreate because that's one of the most easiest and useful ones to use. So once I got it, I'm going to upload it in the Procreate app along with the photos that I just cut out of the people, right? All right, so I notice right away that these, these bricks are huge compared to the people, so I'm going to have to size it down and then duplicate it so it's an actual, you know, size uh, that it would be if they were in front of it. You know what I mean? So it doesn't look funny. And it should match up pretty good. If not, you can take the airbrush and kind of like erase it. But I mean, nobody's going to really pay attention to that. Plus, we're going to put a shadowing on it. Just duplicate that layer. And raise it up. There we go. See, pretty close, right? Yeah, that'll definitely do. All right, so what we're gonna do next is I'm gonna get the airbrush tool, very useful tool. I use it in like everything. Then we're gonna create a new layer and drop black in there. And then I'm gonna hit the erase brush and get the soft brush airbrush again but i got a bigger one up here kind of go in the middle see really makes it pop more i feel like and i created this uh line that goes around and just pop your pop your fun in there and that's pretty much it Appreciate everybody watching. Make sure you hit subscribe and drop a comment if you have any questions. Have a blessed day.